I just came back from a walk and I read the post to the video I just put up. Ivan, I want to apologize to you, but you misunderstood what I said in my last video. I was n I had think very highly of you and your wife, and I appreciate all of your support um, that you've uh, given to me uh, at my YouTube channel. What I was trying to say is not that I think you're crazy, because I do not believe that, nor do I believe that your wife is crazy. What I was trying to say is that Zach Knight does, does not consider you a threat. He's not worried about you. So he allows your comments to be posted at my YouTube channel. I appreciate what you have to say. I actually kind of laugh when I read it because I know, um, I know the, uh, the impression that you're giving to some of my, um, some of the people, the Jesuits who, uh, the Jesuits, how do I say this? Um, the Jesuits don't fear you. They, they think you're funny. Okay. That isn't what I think. It's just that I'm very good at reading Zach Knight's mind. Okay. I know what he's thinking. So I appreciate your comments and thank you for all of your comments. And, um, I do not think you're crazy and I appreciate you and your wife. Um, I apparently, um, how do I say it? I did, I personally believe that Zach Knight used his brain control on you though when you read, when you listened to my video and on your wife to cause you both to misunderstand me and to think that I was insulting you or that I was ashamed of you. And so I'm just going to, I'm um, just make a video to let the world know that I appreciate my Russian fans and I appreciate you and your wife. And um, uh, what I was saying was not what I believe, but what I think Zach Knight is thinking. Zach Knight knows you're not crazy, Ivan. And he knows your wife's not crazy. And he knows I'm not crazy. And he knows that many of my followers are not crazy. But what he's doing is he's studying the uh, people who comment at my YouTube channel and he's only allowing comments from those who he thinks uh, would not be a threat to the image that he wants the world to have of me which is paranoid schizophrenic okay I do not think you're crazy and I don't think Zach Knight thinks you're crazy but he is um, maybe we should call it a cultural difference okay I've noticed that there are cultural differences between Russia and the West. Okay, Russia is much more Russians are much more open about their sexual feelings. I've noticed that even in my relationship with Vladimir Putin, he's very open about his sexual feelings. I believe it's part of your culture. Okay, and Zach Knight is aware that Americans tend to misunderstand the Russian culture, and and he's. He's allowing you to comment because you don't quite understand the American culture and your comments can be misunderstood or misconstrued to make you appear off balance. Um, I, um, I, think, I think very highly of you and I admire your courage. But there are other Russians that I believe that have tried to comment at my channel and I think Zach Knight is blocking them. See, he doesn't consider you a threat. Because to the Western viewer, when they read your stuff, they so I, I'm just saying this to you because I know how the Western mind is. They're going to think, oh, this guy's a little, you know, off. This is not what I think, okay? I think it's a cultural difference that Zack Knight is playing up on, okay? Zack Knight doesn't think you're crazy. I don't think he really believes that, and I don't think you're crazy. But I, I appreciate your comments. What I'm saying is that Zach Knight, he has mind reading technology and he is playing up the differences between the Russian culture and the American culture and using that to help prejudice the Western mind against me. And um, to be honest with you, I appreciate all of your comments and I appreciate your support and I don't want you to take it personal, okay? I was just using you as an example of, because I'm not getting, you know, I know that many, many Russians are watching my YouTube channel, and I find it strange that so few of them are commenting at my YouTube channel. 
I believe that there are many that are trying to get their comments published and Zach Knight is blocking it and they're not getting published. He's allowing some of the Russians to, he's only allowing the comments to go through that will not hurt the, the, uh, the presentation that he wants the world, how he wants the world to see me, okay? So you just keep on supporting me like you do and I appreciate it. And um, I wasn't telling you what I think of you. I don't think you're crazy. And I don't think all of, I don't think all of my commentators think you're crazy, but I just know how people think, especially, and how Jesuits are going to, Jesuits are masters at manipulating public opinion. And they just, I'm, I'm just telling you right out, Zach Knight does not find you threatening, so he allows your comments in. Now, let's say Dmitry Medvedev or uh, what is it, uh, one of those high-ranking Russians or let's say that, uh, you know, some Russian that might have some, res you know, some like a Russian scientist uh, like a, or a Nobel Prize winning Russian writer, none of those. No, if they wanted to comment at my YouTube channel, Zach would block it. He won't let it through. That's, what, that's basically what I'm saying. I love you Russians and I love you and your wife and please don't take it personal, okay? Um, I did not uh, mean for you to take it personal. A personal opinion, I think Zach Knight used a little bit of brain control on you to get you to misunderstand what I was trying to say. But I'm going to make another video and let the world know I don't think you're crazy, but what I was trying to say is that Zach Knight thinks he can point that he doesn't find you a threat because he realizes that, you know, in your great enthusiasm for me, which I really think is, I, I find it refreshing. I love, I actually find the Russian directness about sexuality and all that, I find it very refreshing. But the Jesuits, you got to see over here in the United States that we've got some really stuffy, should I say, Western minds that are not open to the Russian approach to sexuality. And Zach Knight is taking advantage of that. And he's thinking, oh, it's okay if I let this Russian comment because he doesn't, because the way he comes across, I'm sure I can take advantage of the Western stuffiness to, uh, I, it's kind of hard to explain. But let's just put it this way. Zach Knight doesn't find you a threat. So he allows you to comment. Um, he doesn't think that anything you say or do is going to hurt his his attempts to get me portrayed as paranoid schizophrenic. So, but you keep on commenting because I'm going to tell you something. Zach Knight is not totally winning. Uh, there are many. He isn't fooling everybody. And there are. I think there are a lot of my viewers that really appreciate you. Okay. And you know what I think? I think the ones that do appreciate you, he's not allowing them to comment about you. I think he's blocking it. I because I've read some of your comments and I noticed underneath that that there are, that the Jez, Zach Knight is using his Jesuits to uh, to uh, say bad things about you and make you appear like you're a troll or something, which I don't believe. And um, hey, you know what? I think it's kind of good that you got your feelings hurt. Let me tell you why. Because in the past, in the past, you've been accused of being my troll. Well, if you're my troll, then why in the... Nah. This certainly isn't the behavior of a troll. <laughs> you know? You're saying he's my troll. No, he's an independent person, and he's got his own mind. And, uh, and there, are, there are a bit of cultural differences between Russia and the West. And uh, um, you took something personally that I didn't mean for you to take. Uh, like I said, uh, I'm only telling you how Zach Knight thinks of you and why he allows your comments. But I'm certain he's blocking other Russians from commenting. That's basically what I was trying to say. As to what I personally think, I think you're great. I appreciate you and your wife. And I also, um, but have you noticed that you're not getting much support except from me at my YouTube channel? I believe that there are a lot of my followers that like you and Zach is blocking them from supporting you too. So I'm just letting you know that. The, the main point of the last video is that Zach Knight is playing God with the internet. And he's only allowing people to comment that won't threaten the perception that he wants the world to have of me, okay? So don't take it personally. And I really think Zach Knight used brain control on you. And he's done it to me, man. 
Like when I first found out about Lori McBride in 1996, Zach used brain control on me to make me think that um, that uh, that that birthday party that she sponsored. You know, I mean, he he does it to us. He he uses brain control on me all the time, man. He'll use brain control on me to get me to think a certain way, and then I'll, I will uh, contact my men, and they'll let me know that no, 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 that's not the way it is. You know, he does that. He's doing it on my family. For instance, my own mother. She um, got rescued by Hugh Jackman uh, when she was in North Korea. She doesn't remember any of that. Zach not used brain control on her to get her to just forget everything, man. He, he's good at brain control, and he's using brain control. He listened to my video, and he thought, aha, I can get Ivan and his wife all upset. I'm going to use my brain control on them and get them to misunderstand what Gail said so that I can make Gail seem like a real meanie. And that's exactly what he's done. But I'm going to make another video and say, I think you're hot. I appreciate you and your wife. Don't take personally what I said. I wasn't reflecting my opinion. I was reflecting Zach Knight's opinion. 